Morning affirmations for entrepreneurs. Your enemies make you rich. Shalom family and I pray that you all slept and woke well. This is today's morning affirmations for entrepreneurs. Please be prepared to take notes well. Your enemies can make you rich. <laughs> Was that title clickbait? No. That's actually in the Bible. Get straight a few things about effort job. In the mornings, I only give you motivational facts that are proven so you'll never have to get a job. Is that a problem? Hope not. Now let's hop on my soapbox. <laughs> your enemies are only to be exterminated if they have no uses. In your industry right now, there are some of your competitors that have no competing services or products that could be used in your business to boost it. For example, I can bring up Boost. It's a cell phone company that piggybacked off Sprint's service. In exchange, they share customer re revenue with Sprint to grow faster instead of having to invent service. That's called a joint venture partnership, which you can do with me in the video description. But listen, if you look at your enemies as allies, it allows you to leverage their customer base and all assets. Trade them something of equal value and you can grow your income exponentially and you didn't even have to put down cash yet. I laugh at new people and old me that rather destroy the competition. It's time to listen. Ask yourself this. How fast could a new seafood restaurant grow if they agreed to split profits in exchange to use Red Lobster's kitchen? Now all they would have to do is generate delivery only orders through cheap Facebook ads and boom. Now they can do that same joint venture agreement to 20 other restaurants in one week, rake that cash, make that fast. Do you see now? Do you see how you can leverage your enemy's competition as an alternative? Learn to give something of equal value and in return you'll live a far more prosperous life. And guess what? That's in the Bible. Give, give, give. It's better to give and you'll receive. The most high God will make your enemies to be at peace with you. If you could only overcome the greed, you'll lead the industry, but not by wiping them out, but making your competition cheerleaders and permanent referral sources. If you're wondering how I service you this billionaire advice, well, there are forces like the son of God. <laughs> he can be the perfect example for your business. The entire world was a witness of how he gave, gave, gave his life for sinful strangers. Now, kingdom rulership is what his gift is. Guess what? King Solomon traded with Hiram. Even he was from another nation. He was the richest man ever. So, if you could be above the hating and make your enemies your allies, you could easily double payments. So meditate on this before work and send a good morning message to a competing corporation. If you do so, I guarantee you, you'll never have another struggle waiting. Shalom.